And good afternoon. This is Coach Big Pete of DeepThisFootball.com. It is time now for the last, hopefully the last college. Uh, I'm doing uh, most of the rest of the colleges in the state of Illinois preview. Um, mostly NAIA and two D2 schools. So I'm going to go through them. Again, uh, players, please, um, on the bottom of the YouTube, on the bottom of the YouTube video in the description box, and also an article, I will have all these uh, recruiting questionnaires posted, links. Please click on the links, fill them out. This is the best way for you to get recruited. Do not waste money on recruiting services. They are a scam. Go to these recruiting questionnaires and fill them out. Fill out all of these schools, all of them, not just one, all of these schools. They will help you get recruited. Simple as that. And again, when we talk about student athlete, and I talk about student athlete, and I've said this in all the college preview videos and conference videos and all that. You're a student athlete. You're a student first and an athlete second. Simple as that. When you go look at these schools, also please look at the majors. Please look at what they specialize in. Education is valued number one right now. Think about what you want to do for a living and as a major. Simple as that. Okay. So... Time to go over some schools. I'm going to do the NAIA section first, okay? Okay. All right. First, Belleville, Lindenwood. They're in a NAIA school, Belleville, right about, right about St. Louis, almost by St. Louis. Got head coach Kevin uh, Terrico. You might notice them because they got the little red cat whatever uh, logo. <clears throat> they do a good job recruiting in Chicago. They got a couple few Chicago, um, what's it? Chicago Catholic League schools. Uh, they got a couple few kids from there. They got two kids from Mount Carmel, if I'm not mistaken. But again, good school, good education. You're almost, almost, I'd say, by the St. Louis area. It's a good time. Check it out. Belleville, Lindenwood. There's two. Um, there's two Lindenwoods, but this is Lindenwood, Belleville, Lindenwood. So it's a good school. Please check it out. NAIA. Kevin Turco, you guys have seen on Twitter. Follow Kevin Turco. Next, Olivet Nazarene in Bourbon, where the Bears did their uh, fall camp. Olivet Nazarene, class coaching staff, very great coaching staff. I've met about four of their coaches, great guys, good staff, great school to get an education. I know about maybe a fourth of the kids that played there because I coached against them in I-8, but Olivet Nazarene is a school that you definitely want to check out. Beautiful area in the Bourbon A area. Check it out. Fill out the questionnaire. Um, great. They do a great job recruiting up in the Chicagoland area. They have a couple few professional athletes that actually went to Olivet Nazarene too. But it's a good school. A good. F uh, it's okay football team. Going to get better. But check it out. It's a, it's a football program on the rise. Next one. Robert Morris, Chicago. There's a Robert Morris Peoria, but this, I'm talking about the Robert Morris Chicago. Um, Robert Morris Chicago, as you know, recruits heavy in the Chicagoland area. Um, also in the central Illinois area, too. Again, like I said, if you have, if you are interested in the nightlife and all that other stuff, you'd look at that type of school and look at Robert Morris in Chicago. I think they're on Dearborn, if I'm not mistaken. I probably am. But check it out. Robert Morris, good football team, pretty good football team. Um, they get a good group of recruits, especially in the Collar counties of Chicago, Robert Morris. But, again, another school that you would want to check out. I've seen a bunch of their coaches and their recruiting things. Uh, they were Elmhurst, and I've, if I'm not mistaken, they were at – I'm trying to put my finger. They were on another school too, but they do a good job. And it's a great school to check out. They've offered a bunch of uh, Chicago land kids, like I said. A lot of the metro suburban kids get offers from, uh, uh, how do you say, the Robert Morris. But since it's cool to check out, I will have the questionnaire. Please fill it out. Next one, St. Francis in Juliet. Good school. They got the dogs thing. You might see the coach, Joe Curry. Uh, he's on uh, He's on Twitter. He's on a Twitter sphere. Good season staff. A lot of uh, season vet coaches on that staff. Um have a good history of recruiting. You guys might have went stop by their college camp. It's a pretty good college camp from what I've heard about. Um, 
<clears throat> made some headlines in the past. Very open staff, very uh, good coaches. Um, another school that's on the, sort of on the verge, just a little bit like a Bradley Bourbonnet to look out for. But say, Juliet St. Francis, please fill up the questionnaire. Next one, and this is the weirdest one that I can ever come by. NAIA, Trinity International in Deerfield, Illinois. I'm going to say this school is one of the weirdest schools that I have ever seen because their connections to the NFL is completely crazy. That's all I'm just going to say. It. Um, I think you still have, I think Nate Vasher's coaching there. Um, they had uh, Leslie Frazier, as you know, was an NFL coach who coached there. You also have uh, um, uh, Kevin Bell from Iowa who coached at uh, TIU, but Trinity International is just one of those weird schools, but for all the right reasons, it's it's awesome. It's a great place. Uh, I've driven past it a couple times. Look, it's almost right by Lake Forest College, but Trinity International gets a good group of kids, Good uh, makes great offers to some good kids uh, Very that are very high character and all that other stuff, so... Trinity International uh, is another school. Fill out the questionnaire. Next one, St. Xavier. St. Xavier is a little bit like St. Francis. Season staff, Chicago School, St. St. Uh, St. I'm sorry, St. Xavier, St. Xavier, Chicago School, Chicago Land Players. Um, you got the coach Daniel, uh, assistant coach. Um, I'm forgetting the first. I uh, uh, forget his last name. The head coach. But again, they they do a good job picking up a bunch of kids. I've had uh, two players, uh, two players uh, when I was coaching that went to Saint uh, to Saint Xavier. They they loved it. They did a great job at Saint Xavier. But again, it's a school that's uh, slowly a lot of people don't know about. It's one. It's like the red hair stepchild of Chicago colleges. Saint Xavier is one of those, and a lot of people don't even realize that it's NAIA. Some people think it's Division Three. No, it's NAIA. So St. Xavier, fill up the questionnaire. Some funny coaches, too. They, they're actually pretty funny on Twitter. They have a lot of them on Twitter, too. So does Trinity International. All right, next we're going to Division Two. Two schools. We got McKendry. McKendry, as you know, is be really popular on Twitter. Sphere. very good job on Twitter. Um, from Coach Babcock uh to um forgetting his name it's gonna kill me he's gonna kick my ass for it though but it doesn't matter um just a good group of coaches i've met them they have great camps um they attack the state of illinois they make a lot of offers good school mckendry they're the, they're the purple school if you guys need to know that are just the purple colors and everything but mckendry does a great job of recruiting upstate central illinois southern illinois they're down in lebanon illinois but again, another quality school, McKendry, with their recruiting. It's a it's going to be a school to watch because they're really on their eyes. Look out for McKendry. But Coach Matt, uh, Babcock does a great job. Uh, sort of a young coach. Um, he's got the program on an upswing. It's going to be something something to behold. Now, last one for D Division Two. You have Quincy. Um, interim coach Gary Bass, small town Quincy, Illinois. But a good, good, solid Division II program to take a look at. They're the Eagles. As you, well, not Eagles, but Hawks, as you can see. Uh, but again, a school that you want to fill out, that you want to take a look at. Quincy, they have, a, they have an interim coach. They have an interim coordinators. But again, I think they're going to do a good job. I think after talking to a couple few of the young players that go to Quincy, they really like the coaching staff. So it's the coaching staff to keep a close eye on. But again, Quincy, McKendry, St. Xavier, Trinity International, St. Francis, Robert Morris, Chicago, Olive and Nazarene, and Lindenwood, Belleville are all schools that you kids want to fill out. Fill out those recruiting questionnaires. They will help you get recruited. I will have them on the bottom of the YouTube description box. Please fill them out. If you like what I had to say, please follow Coach Big Pete and Deep Dish Football on Twitter and Facebook. You can also follow me on Instagram at Coach Big Pete. Also visit deepdishfootball.com if you like what I had to say. Please, on the right-hand section, feel free to leave a tip, a donation, whatever. But again, please, recruits, fill out all these questionnaires. These are free questionnaires, easy for you to, easy for you to get recruited. Simple as that. 
If you have any questions or comments, please email me at coachbigpetefp at gmail.com. Thank you so much, and have a lovely day.